in whether the hurricane season nears its peak in September. Ian, are we watching anything? Well, at this uh, time, obviously, with the waters are warming up, we also have uh, the lowest the wind shear as well as a warmer air, and we also get a lot of moisture via the rains that come off of Africa. So obviously at this time, all those tropical waves which aren't leaving, there are a couple out there, and there's uh, one just in the middle, midway between us and Africa, that has an area of low pressure, that one will be watched. And then there's another one uh, just a bit closer towards where we are, and that will likely begin to impact us as you go through late on Saturday. But right now, we still have a bit of ITCZ action towards the south, and some of that moisture has been bringing in a few showers, especially over southern areas of Trinidad. They have been seeing some of those showers turning heavy and thundery there. We could be seeing some of that activity continuing overnight into your Saturday. So showers are likely then as we go into tomorrow, especially for the weekend and then on to Sunday. Possibly see some heavier showers as well as we get the tail end of that tropical wave. Meanwhile, offshore, those winds will remain fresh from the east at 20 knots, still bringing moderate choppy seas, one and a half to two meters offshore with those short east northeasterly swells of seven seconds. Seconds. And if you are heading out, just your high tide at 6.30 a.m. The next one is at 7.15 p.m. So that's your weather.